Numbers can represent a wide range of values and for this video we're going to use a value that can be both counted and measured. Steps up the screen. For the sake of simplicity in this video we'll only consider whole numbers of steps but the same principles apply with distances that are not a whole number of steps. Let's start by taking some steps up the screen, even more than one step at a time. We'll mark the steps next to each other so that we can look back at our path. To track our progress, let's draw a line next to our path and mark it with the number of steps we are up from our starting point. As a line with numbers next to it, let's call it a number line. This arrow here shows that there is no upper limit to our number line. We could just keep walking forwards forever and adding more steps. We would just have to zoom out a little on our number line to see these steps. Our total distance up the screen is now the sum of our steps, and we can show this with an equation. By convention, number lines are shown horizontally with negative to the left and positive to the right but it is rotated here to allow the equation to be shown with the steps in line with the arrows. We can also take steps towards the bottom of the screen, and these subtract from our total distance up, so we'll call them minus steps. They are the same size as the forward steps, but in the opposite direction. Using plus and minus like this is called directed numbers. So what happens when we want to walk further down the screen than our start position? Well, we can do this by extending our path in the opposite direction, still using the same starting point with a zero mark to show that it is zero steps up from our starting point. Now, as we step below our starting point, we need to start using negative numbers because we are negative steps above our starting point. As with the positive direction, we can continue our negative direction forever as well, always getting further below our starting point. Once you have your number line set up, you can add and subtract as much as you like. Addition steps move you up the screen in the positive direction, and subtraction steps move you down the screen in the negative direction. Your final position is the answer to the equation with all the addition and subtraction steps.